the, the only source of renewable energy that's large enough to fill all society's needs is solar energy. The goal of this research that we're working on is to try to find ways to, to make cheaper kinds of solar cells. These will be solar cells that are made of organic materials. They'll be like plastic. You can make them on rolls. They'll be easily processed. And potentially then they'll be uh, cheap enough so we can use them to replace a lot of our reliance on fossil fuels. Dominant energy source in this world has always been solar energy. And our job is to uh, produce materials that can make it more efficient. One of the great things about the materials we're uh, making and the materials that are being looked at for these new sort of organic solar cell types is that we can make them in a very cheap way and we can make them in a flexible way. One of the things that uh, is characterized by the people on this team is that they all have a lot of creativity. We're making materials that never existed on the earth before and you need a creative person to do that. We're making the uh, polymer material based on a, a light absorbing material called dye and we can polymerize that and isolate it and purify it and uh, currently we are the only research group in the world working on this because it is brand new and this is our sort of material that we want to compare with the rest of the world's materials. Most of this research, in fact, is carried out by students at all levels. So these might be undergraduates or graduate students or postdocs or more advanced researchers. And the university is a good place for uh, people like that to uh, congregate. We are able to think about something. We're able to make a hypothesis. We're able to test it. We're able to have serendipitous research discoveries. Without research, nothing would ever change.